so as you can see this is the kind of perps that lives around me right this is somebody who's, who works on me and does things to me um if it's the thoughts manipulations or whatever but you know it's funny he say i think he said my name i'm not sure and now you know i'm being pleasant because you know i'm recording and so i know these people are just trash you know this is what happens if you're talking if you have people like him um involved there, there could be your neighbors it could be people who are um who, who are just trying to get you to accept these nasty manipulations you know two seconds ago they would try to make me imagine they're like oh they're gonna rape you in the butt like this is the things i, I keep hearing right and it's meant to create anxiety at this point i don't care what's gonna happen to me as long as i don't i'm just thankful that i didn't have to live their life and then they try to make me imagine a disturbing thoughts of a child and because i was like instead of raping way you know like i'm like they just said this like childlike things to me I'm like rape me in the butt instead of raping me where and then, and then they try to make me imagine some things with oral right it's nasty right uh and i don't you know like I, there's nothing i can do about that but that's the things they do to me i'm forced to experience and think of the most disturbing things and and i made it when i said where they just i knew it was gonna go somewhere with a child and it was gonna consist of somebody's some it's just disgusting right and it's just nasty and they're like, no, remember what you did as a kid. And of course, they have created a version of, of, of their own reality. Falsify as, as, as hell. But to try to create this thought is disgusting. This is this kind of people who are supposed to do this. You know, I just got back from outside. I was, you know, a bunch of people trying to be like, make me look at, like, try to look like all mean. And I was listening to the fact that I'm validated. I'm validated by the fact that there's a bunch of pedophilia going on in these agencies that contract these low lives. Right? It's like, I know who's the pedos. I know you do the pedophilia type of torture. I know this thing is, is this is why you can say Roy Moore. I went to this place and there was like somebody who looked like a teenager. I was like, uh, I'm going to film all this because I know in my mind it's going to be something else. And then it's funny, when I get back here, I open my, my, my messaging and I see some babies and because somebody sent me a bit, uh, like this baby boy and like it's just immediately they try to create this perception of like sexuality and just make me aim at this kid who's wearing pampers. And, like just to force me to him the crotch area of this pampers. It's just retardations. And try to give me stimulations. I'm supposed to be subscriptive to this. I'm supposed to be like, oh, it's me. And you hear people in the hallway try to make noise campaign, try to get you to accept and tell me what's going to be. It's like, listen, whatever's going to happen to me, you guys do this pedophilia type of torture, and I'd rather get tortured the way you tell me I'm going to be tortured. Then having to live the life that you do. Look at these people. This, they have the choice of living any life they want. This is what they chose to, to do. I'm t like I could not ever pick that like it's not even like something I can just imagine and if I ever fell into that world where this they do these things out I'm just so thankful I didn't have to get, live this life because as somebody who's being tortured who's t being told all these horrible things that are going to happen to him I see these big guys trying to show up I'm like listen I'm very skinny small and I'm not fearful of that because I know there's worse things than what these people do this technology can do every horrible th torture you can imagine with that a single person there every pain and torment you can imagine can be done remotely and sometimes nothing is actually happening to you and they use these bottom feeders this at least this person looks more like an adult person you should see you should see some of the people they use that's when you know the sophistication of this technology that they don't even need actually functioning adults that anybody could be involved in this they're trash. They have no shame and they have normalized using pedophilia type of torment. That's why you see these things when I show like mothers bringing their kids and wanting me to look at their kids so they can do these pedophilia things they're not to be doing. People sending pictures of their babies and so, just so can they can create some nasty perception or nasty manipulation of some sort. It's disgusting, it's foul, but that's what they do. And so to all my target individual, find yourself lucky because you could be living that life of these people trying to get you to accept these manipulations. And there's a lot of them, right? They've normalized it. Find yourself lucky you're, the one of, you're not one of the people who've normalized this disgusting lifestyle of forcing people to do what they do. And they try to f sound fierce. Everything they've done to me, they've done it to others, right? Nothing is new to me. I mean, nothing is new in regard of just to me. Like you uh, Nothing is done specifically to me. Everything they've done to me have been done to others. Now they try to, like, you see how they try to force me to say different things to, to try to mess with me. This is called forced speech. Something they've done to others too. There is nothing new.
in regard of what I'm experiencing, for, like in regard of the torment that make, they, they're making me experience. This torment is also applied onto many others. That's one way I can talk about the perfect type of torture. I know they've done this to other people. That's why I use that word. That word has been used on the, while others testimony, the other testimonies. The, the way they stimulate you, the way they make you think, all of that is all things they've done before. And I'm one of many who experience this disturbing things they've done to others. I'm not unique. They've done this to many others and they'll continue to do this to others. As much as they try to make me subscribe, they're like, no, you felt that when you were a kid. Well, like, yes. That's what they do to people. They force you, an adult man or woman, or even children, to get these disturbing manipulations of all sorts. And to force you to accept this using the utmost illogicalness and manipulations to try to get you to subscribe to it. Be strong and know that justice will be done. These people have sold their soul to pedophiles. There's a bunch of pedos contracting, there's a bunch of pedos running these, running these entities, being on top of these entities, from DARPA to DOD to CIA. There's an issue of pedophilia, a pattern of pedophilia. Now, it's unfortunate for this contracted trash that wanted to delude themselves in something else. But reality is, reality will always come back and get to them. So stay strong and know that justice will be done.